I tried it out and I've shot up 100 MMR in 48 hours. Jeez, bro. I've told you. The sauce. The secret sauce. So have you ever left a ranked game not sure what to think about for the next one or you just don't know why you're losing? Well, today I was getting some coaching from Rapid and he shared this one strategy that instantly changed how I play ranked. Here's what he said. The worst thing you can do if you want to win your ranked games is try to play a certain play style. For example, he said you shouldn't enter the game thinking things like I need to play more passive or I need to challenge faster. Here's why. Because that's what most people don't realize. Like I'm going in there with a plan, but the plan is going to be different every game. So why do I go in there and think in the same exact way when it's not, you know what I mean? I got to be adaptive to like what the game is. And if you're not doing that, right, then you're just going to be forcing things that were never there. Make the play when you have it. Don't force yourself to be there to make the play. Let the play come to you. He said, if you want to play your best, thinking about what to do before you play ranked will only distract you. Instead, the only thing he ever allows himself to think about when playing at the top of the ranked ladder is watching the opponents. If he's stuck on defense, he's going to play defense for as long as he needs to. If he has no boost and needs to play the ball, he'll suck it up and go for the ball. If he's stuck a second man, he's going to wait behind no matter how long that takes. Because no matter what your play is, the minute you try to force something is usually the moment you overcommit and make a mistake. You have to be able to play situationally and be able to change what you're doing no matter who you're playing. And you just limit yourself. Because like, what if a team is like constantly passing middle? and no one's ever covering it, right? And now you should have been there and you're just like, oh, I'm back post. You know, it just creates bad habits of thinking that you need to be doing something when that's not the right answer. So if you're somebody who overthinks things, or just can never seem to play their best in actual games, try this out. That or just stop using big boosts to pick up more big boosts. That might help too. By the way, if you're between the plat and champ ranks and are 18 plus years old watching right now, DM me on Discord with the keyword cut to get in on my coaching program before we sell out this month. Or if you're below 18 years old, no sweat. You can still join my free Discord for more training tips like these. And as always, links in the description below. Thanks for watching.